Hello and welcome to the morning encouragement from Smart Penabur, Kota Wisata. I hope that every one of you are in a good health. Today's morning devotion is served by Shanti and Andrea from Student Council Sector 10. And the opening song is presented by Lydia Rosalinda from 11 Science 2 and Nicholas Edward from 10 Science 3. Now, let's listen to them. Before we start our devotion, let's pray. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for this new day. Thank you for your abundant love and your blessings upon us. Now, before we start our learning, we would like to hear your words. Please bless us so that we can understand and apply it in our daily lives. In your name we pray. Amen. Today's morning devotion is taken from Galatians 6 verse 10, which is titled, Take advantage of the opportunity to do good. As said in Galatians 6 verse 10, Therefore, as we have opportunity, let us do good to all people, especially to those who are of the household of faith. The call to believers is to take advantage of every opportunity to do good and be helpful to all people, but especially to those who are of the household of faith, your brothers and sisters in Christ. Kindness to others is kindness to Christ, Jesus himself declares in Matthew 25, verse 40. The king will answer, Truly I say to you, as you have done it for the one of the least of these brothers of mine, you have done it for me. Today, we have many opportunities to help. There is always the opportunity to help others. There is always the chance for you to do good deeds and help to make the world a better place, for instance. The question to be answered by all of us is, are you willing to help where there is a need? Apostle James asked this question in James 2 verse 14 until 16. My friends, what good is it to say you have faith when you don't do anything to show that you really have faith? Can that kind of faith save you? If you know someone who doesn't have any clothes or food, you shouldn't just say, I hope all goes well for you. I hope you will be warm and have plenty to eat. What good is it to say this unless you do something to help? Faith that doesn't lead us to do good deeds is all alone and dead. Let's take the situation we are in for example. We are told to stay at home for our own safety. But whilst being at home, we can still take the opportunity to do good to others, such as giving out donations to those in need at a time like this. What is best is to not just stand there and do nothing about it. When there's a chance for you to fix or do something, when there's that opportunity which lies on your hands, take it. Jesus went about doing good to all when the opportunity presented itself. 
He even went out the way to help those that he knew needed him, but did not seek him out. The Samaritan woman at the well is another example of this. Let this mind be in you, which is also in Christ Jesus. Be not only the listeners, but also doers, by taking advantage of the opportunity which presents itself to you. God bless. Let us pray. Dear Lord, thank you for the graces you have given upon us. Today, we learn that we should do good deeds and lend a helping hand to those in need by taking advantage of the opportunities that we have. Please give us a heart that's willing to help. Now, we are going to start our learning. We ask for your blessings so that everything can go well. The learning, the internet connection, and all the medias that we are going to use. Now, before we end our devotion, let us pray the Lord's Prayer. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we also have forgiven those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. That's the end of our morning devotion today. I'd like to say, have a blessed day and God bless.